So this review is for the King Kong Blu-ray. This is the 1933 movie starring uh, Fei Wei as Ann Darrow. Um, this movie was released by Radio Pictures, which later became RKO. Um, this is how this is the Digibook. If you're not familiar with the Digibook, it's basically the Blu-ray movie housed in a bookcase instead of the regular um, Blu-ray cases. So this is the front of it. Uh, this is the back of it. And this is the paper that actually comes with the movie um, when you're opening it for the first time. Um, and it has special features which are dissimilar to the ones from the special edition DVD that um, came out a few years ago. Um, now I'm going to open it and show you some of the pages from the book. Um, this is what it looks like when you open it. Uh, King Kong. Um, this are just some um, pages from the book. I'm not going to show you all of it. I'm just going to show you like some of them. Yeah. King Kong, and I'm actually going to show you, there's a really nice picture, um, King Kong, this is a reproduction of one of the original um, posters, and then finally, this is a picture from one of the very last scenes of the movie, and then at the end of the movie, you're getting, uh, again, just like the front, but this time you're getting this glass this plastic um, case holder to hold your um, King Kong movie. I know with the Digibooks from Fox, they don't have this um, plastic um, holder. Um, so like I said earlier, the movie came out in 1933, but in 1938, because they had really stricter sensors than they do today, believe me, um, a lot of the scenes, some scenes that were either too scary or too grotesque were um, cut from the movie in for the 1938 release. Uh, from 1938 till about the 60s, those scenes, every time the movie was shown, it was shown without those scenes. Um, in the 60s, those scenes were put back into a copy of the movie, and the movie was shown through the art house scenes. Um, Recently, there has been a copy of the original 33 version found in the UK, and that's because the UK doesn't didn't have stricter censors than they did the um, US. Um, there is one scene that is lost forever. It's called the uh, spider pit scene. Um, the scene is included in the DVD, but it's the but what but the one that's included in this Blu-ray is the one that Peter Jackson created when he was creating his movie, um, the King Kong remake. Um, he was inspired by the movie to do it, and he did it, and it's in here. So it's great to see what that scene would have looked like. Um, but if there's anybody that knows where that scene is, please contact Warner Brothers, you know, Universal. You know, they would like to have that scene. But anyway, this is King Kong on Blu-ray in a Digibook pack. So until next time, bye.